So here's a challenge where, say, in the state of Ohio, some furniture rental is needed. So it's needed to start on the 28th of July, ending on the 10th of August, a recliner, and they need 135. And here is the complete inventory here. And James Taze has this set up wonderfully where everything in Ohio is highlighted because Ohio is in the uh, in the in A2. So if we change to Indiana, now everything in Indiana is highlighted, and we can tell that they want 135. 32 more are needed, so we can't rent there. So what happens if we say that okay, 80 is good enough? Oh, okay, so they are available. All right, so the formula is a sum product, right? Because he said that he tried uh, some ifs and it didn't work so well. So he pulled out the sum product, and I won't go all through all of the details here, but what's happening is it's saying go through column J, the state column, and wherever it's equal to. A2, Indiana, and then multiply that by the amount, right, in. And we do that again with the item, recliner, and then here is the really tricky part is looking at the time period. Right, so now we can see what is available during that full time period. So let's see, let's change something here. So we're looking at recliners. Ah, uh, recliners. In Indiana. So I'm going to change something here. Got Michigan recliners. Now, what if these people, they needed these recliners until 12 September? Okay, and okay. So this this isn't a good example, um, but you know, okay. When we go to three hundred ninety, they aren't enough. You need ninety more. But this sum product is really the point. This is what was able to find out what's available and what's not based on the state, the time that is needed, and the item. So that is the hot tip. And thank you, James Taze. Come back here. All right. Let's see. So let's do four bottles of sriracha for that, for thinking about the layout there, right? Because that's that's the big thing, the layout and thinking through and using that sum product. So I, I also, I also, if, if I remember correctly, uh, there's, a, there's a prize for, for Mr. Taze, is that right? Yes, yes, I've arranged for his bottle of ghost pepper sriracha to be sent to him from California Blazing Chili Farms. <laughs> 